Well, um, we hope that on Friday after the ga uh, Thursday after the game that we can go out and do Bourbon Street a little bit with the team, uh, do some beignets and some oysters, but that's depending on how things go. <laughs> and then Friday morning we're going to wake up and go do mufalada sandwiches from Central Grocery and then sit outside the, the river and eat them just to let them have a little bit of New Orleans. Well, that's the thing that now is starting to creep into my brain, you know, sleepless sleepless nights that yeah we're three and one and as a basketball coach you have to convince your team that on any given day somebody can beat you um, and knock you off where we have a small bullseye on our back not a huge one yet and by beating a team like Lamar it can make their season so it's just a matter of convincing them that you have to show up you have to play for 40 minutes we have to do our things um, and it, it's just a you know a matter of selling that to your team this is the time for us to maybe play more players, get them in the rotation, see what they can do and give them their confidence. Um, so it's important. It's important for us to just go and play and make sure that we get our job done and come back and get the W. Well, I mean, I think that we had our back against the, the wall against Stephen F. Austin. So it was a matter of, hey, we can either pull together as a team and come out and get the wins or we can crumble. So we, we just kind of gritted it out. And once we beat Northwestern State at Northwestern State, it gave us confidence. They shot 59% from the field, and we still beat them by 10. You know, so you show them those type of stats and think, hey, see, this is starting to work. And we're trying to sell to them what really works for us, and it's our defense. Our defense disrupts the other team's offense, and then you know we're going to always get that three-point shot and, and you know, live that way. So it's, it's, it's just a matter of us being intense for 40 minutes and trying to be smart and got, get in foul trouble. And we still played all those games with players in foul trouble. So it's just a matter of other people are stepping up. If we have five people in double figures, it's tough to beat us. Yeah, I mean, I didn't want to lose the Stephen F. Austin, but, you know, and I knew when I saw the schedule that these first four games were going to be tough games. And, you know, you have to go on the road and play the first two. Um, and so I knew that, you know, if we're come out three and one, it's something, you know, and not knowing which team would beat us, that we're kind of where we need to be. We're second in the conference. We're getting our confidence. We're starting to get our swag a little bit. And now it's just to continue and not let anybody knock us off our perch. Well, I mean, we did play four of the best teams, you know, right away. And now we've proved that, see, it is working. You did beat three of them. You're going to still get your other shot again to, you know, do a little payback to Stephen F. Austin. So it's just a matter of continuing to win and put ourselves in a situation to be successful. And if we're second, something happens to them, and, you know, we'll just take care of our business and let something happen to that number one ranked team, and then we can be in the driver's seat.